right, welcome back to the channel. I'm King of Bad. In today's video, we're back playing Dark. Uh, it's been a while since I recorded. I'm not doing that full XCOM playthrough anymore. Trying to play XCOM 1 just pissed me off the whole time. Because basically, the way the game was playing, and I tried it on different settings. Well, no, I didn't try it on different settings. But I didn't want to play it on easy mode because I didn't want it to be a cakewalk or anything like that. But basically, the game was just like bullshit. It was giving me bullshit and I wasn't appreciating it. It felt like... The enemies were doing shit that I couldn't do at all, which was annoying. Because if they can throw a grenade at me from this distance, why can't I throw a grenade back at them? It was basically what my issue was. And a lot of stuff like that was just getting on my nerves. It was more of an annoyance, and it wasn't really fun for me to play. And most, I'm doing the YouTube thing for fun, first and foremost. So I just cut that out. And then there's another strategy game that I think I don't know if I talked about it at all on the channel, but it's called Phoenix Point. I tried to play that game too. Um, but I tried to play it right after playing XCOM, which was right after playing Chimera Squad. So it was probably just too much strategy game. So I gave myself a break from those. Didn't even enjoy playing it like in my own free time. So now we're back playing Dark, which is a game I did enjoy playing, and a lot of people seem to like. So I brought it back basically and plus there was more dlc to it i was like where's the dlc at i thought i had missed it or something the first time i played through it but might as well use it as the little comeback video while i was gone too like i just i just stopped posting because i got tired basically didn't feel like doing it uh didn't feel like doing it so i just went on a break but one of my videos decided to just blow up out of nowhere like it was wild I think I like it's in the tens of thousands of views so it was pretty good I don't know if it's gonna hold for like anything long term but still nice to see something blow up I was kind of a the only bad part or like annoying part I guess I'm not really upset was that it's just in the middle of the Spongebob series the series that series is already over so I can't even like piggyback off of it or push anything up about it but it was the season finale of it I guess so that's pretty good uh really appreciated it <laughs> nice to see and then i think my followers well, i'm not followers but subscribers went up like 20 not 20 they went up they like doubled or quadrupled one of those two i can't remember if i was sitting up closer to 20 or 40 subscribers before but it's nice to see people watching it's all about the fun of it first and foremost for me i'm not really trying to do it for money just need something to do occupy your mind or whatever Trying to do this one i just recorded this game a second ago but i forgot to push record like actually push record so i had to come back and redo it basically i don't think this is going to be a long video but it was a nice little starter uh needs to be lowered by one again i think There we go. And I gotta not mess up and hit that again. There we go. Like I knew I had it. I've already done it, but like even the first I said it the first time I did it, so like I know I got it. Cause you know it's not that difficult. Still took me a second though. Okay. So, yeah, coming back into the YouTube stuff, uh, I want to do more, like, a lot of different games this year and going forward, I guess, instead of focusing solely on strategy games. But if I do a strategy game, it's probably going to be a full playthrough. Uh, and a lot of these other games might just be one offs or whatever, like, or something small, smaller series like that, instead of the long 20 plus part episodes I was doing for XCOM Chimera Squad and give me that and spongebob i think spongebob was also a pretty long one i don't know any other long games that i did battlefront battlefront was a long one too but that's because i started doing chimera squad in the middle of it and then didn't actually finish that series until i finished the chimera squad playthrough now nah, i gotta skip this one for now 
I'm upset because I did it without a playthrough the first time too. Like any help from a playthrough, it was a pretty straightforward play at least. Well, it wasn't straightforward. It took me like 30 minutes to do it the first time, but now I'm just running through it. So what? What's the order? Key cross I. Uh, I should probably put this in first. So now I'm really just climbing up and then back down and doing it all. Key cross I triangle. That's the only annoying part about forgetting to record. But I think it's going to be fine overall. Key. Ooh, not that. Cross. I. I. What? Was it key cross skull eye? No. Key cross I skull. Yeah, it is. Wait, what? key cross. That's what I did. It just didn't go. Th well, whatever. I'm gonna do it again. Key cross I skull. Cross. I. I don't know why I canceled last time. Skull. And then, but it's gross. Like to me, this whole section, like this gooey, fleshy area, it's weird. Like it doesn't feel like it needs to be there, but I like how they didn't just make it basic. And I wish they did more like the dimension changes and stuff like that throughout all of this. Let me switch back around. A key. Is there something over here? Yeah, there is. I was a dumbass at this part, so I was like, I don't know how to do it. I didn't know you could go down at first, but when I first did it, it was pretty straightforward. Like it's easy task to complete. What did I say the first time? I'm glad I'm smart. Because otherwise it would have taken me forever to do it. But like in this one, I was able to like talk and do it the first time, but now I even know what I'm doing. So I don't know. I get quiet, but that's just because I was forgetting, I guess, that I was doing a video. But still, it's like pretty straightforward overall. I couldn't do that one in real life where you have like the three pegs or whatever. That one in real life always threw me for a loop, but I don't know why that one came so simply to me. And then... I don't, I don't think you need to slide that time. Another extension cord. Now I need to go back down to four three. No, Ooh, that extension cord. And I feel like I'm still finna miss the skull and have to run back in and do it again. I need to be on the floor up here, up here. I think it's uh There we go. Whoosh. Drop it. Let go, go forward. Drop it there. Uh, but that's this. I'm missing the skull, I think. Or head, technically. They're not skulls. They're just severed heads. If we want to get technical with it, I guess. I think I'm. I feel like I'm missing one. I hit this one already. Oh, don't. Uh, we got the skull up top already. I feel like I'm missing one, right? 
think it's five heads. We didn't get one out of here. That's just a flip to this the gooey dimension. I don't think we go up any further. Nah. Uh, not here. Then we gotta sacrifice our own head for it, which is fucking crazy. But it's still a cool concept, like sacrifice a part of your body. Like we already collected arms, legs. Now we're doing skulls. Like it's getting gross out here, but we're good overall, you know. Got that disembodied head, like I don't even know, like who. Jack Skellington. He's a skeleton. Skeleton. I almost said whatever. Anyways, he's already missing like part of his body, anyways. But I only have three severed heads, so I'm missing two. And I can't remember where they are at all. I guess I'll be doing the rest of this head boost. Let's make sure this door stays open just in case. There's no flesh changing areas here. Back here, there's nothing, right? No, there's a skull right here completely missed it. I don't know what I was doing, but then there's nothing else in this room. So we still have another skull to find. Yep. Forgot to come up here. So the two simplest, most open skulls are the ones that I missed. Forgot to it. The one that's just right next to my ankle. And then the very first one that you're supposed to find. How do I even do that? The, I must have actually no. I don't even know what I did the first time to miss those. I guess just not move around in that area. But that's gonna be all. Awesome. Yeah, that shit fucking hurts. These like these are actual skulls being used to power it instead of just like an arm or a leg like it was before. Actually, I don't even. Yeah, the legs powered an elevator, so they weren't even technically electrocuted. But still, uh, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to like the video, subscribe, all that stuff helps me grow up the channel.